Matthews, Matthews chapter 4, verse 23. And Yahweh went about all Galilee, teaching in their synagogues and preaching the gospel of the kingdom and healing all manners of sickness and all manner of diseases amongst the people. I like to give all prayers and honor and glory to Yah Bashanel Shah Bashir Kakradash, the Wadi Yabashanel Shah, for giving us the apostles and the elders, the great millstone, who deserve double honors, right? We so shalom to the Aki, pushing the word of sincerity and truth, for being faith based and being prepared for what is to come and what is to come. Race wars, famine, concentration camps, the RFID, triple to the mark of the beast, 200 million missiles hit the soil of America. Some of them say the chariots of the Lord all for elect into the chambers. Some of them say the chariots of the Lord shooting laser beams at the ungodly and the heathens. Rightfully so. Hey, um, I work with all the Lord to post up the video. I'm just a vessel, man. And um, it feels good, man. This thing feel good, bro. It really do, man. I never, hey, man. I just, I wake up and, and it feels good, man, to know this, man. Hey, I was just looking at, I was just, Trying to figure out um, how we're going to navigate through this, through this, through this um, you know, my phone, cell phone, right? Yeah. And which makes logical sense, man. When you think about it, um, um, so I decided to look up the word gospel. All right. Um, it's all uh, G. 2098, which is uh, I don't know if the secretary pronounced this because I'm not a uh, here we go. Eugelian, Eugelian, right? That's how you say it in Greek, right? Eugelian, which means a reward for good tidings, right? That's God's reward. For good tidings, good tidings, a glad tidings of the kingdom of Yahweh soon to be set up, and subsequently also of Yahweh, also of Yahweh Shah, the Messiah, the Mashiach, the founder of this kingdom. <laughs> I mean, it's gonna be some establishment. This gospel is going to be established, man. Whom y'all shout for that wonderfulness? That's wonderful, man. Because we're looking at this ordeal. Something's got. To, if something's going, to, if a if a kingdom's going to be established, so whatever this kingdom is, it's going to something a kingdom that's going to be unestablished. Cause what's that? How you say it translated from one king, one kingdom to another? That's an apocrypha. Let me see if I can find that. Salak. So fast. Translated in Apocrypha. I'm trying to just use that word, but from one kingdom to another in Apocrypha Sirach. I can't remember that verse. It's lucky. This came in my head. I can't remember how it goes. Roughly paraphrasing. That this kingdom is going to be one kingdom, it's going to be translated from another. I feel like I'm this man. I got a bad memory. But, um, yeah, I know that verse. If you could report, if um, any brother could, um, post it up in, um, in the comment board, that'd be beautiful. Because, uh, 
that's why the body needs to be together, man, because, <laughs> you know, coming out of this world, you know, I probably would have damaged myself in the world, but, you know, at least, this, um, this, this, uh, oh, hold on, look what it says right here, it says, um, the founder of a, of the kingdom after the death of Mashiach, right, yeah, you have Mashiach, was he, um, he, um, he established the kingdom when he had when he was put on the cross. That's when he got established. Said, okay, boom. Now the mission is complete. Now we just gotta wait for the, your, your brothers to finish their mission, and that's what's happening. Our mission is being complete. All right, let's prove that. I get that one. Let's prove that one. All right, that goes to Revelation chapter seven. Who says Revelation chapter seven? Let's see, let's see something there. It's a lot there, because I can, you know, um, let's read some of this. All right, let's read this. Revelation chapter 7, verse 1. And after these things, I saw four angels standing on the four corners of the earth, holding the four winds of the earth. That's the nuclear wind, man. That the wind should not blow on the earth, nor on the sea, nor on the trees. And I saw another angel ascending from the east, having the seal of the living power. And he cried with a loud voice to the other angels, right? Like, oh, hold on! To the four angels, to whom it was it was given. To hurt the earth. They go to the point right there that the wind, it ain't regular wind. To hurt the earth and the sea. Saying, hurt not the earth, neither the sea, nor the trees, till we seal, till we. And it means the angels are involved. <laughs> right there. They go, we. Till we seal the servants. So that's a mission got A mission got to be complete. So how are you going to get sealed when your mission is complete? Oh, this one get it. Good. Give it. Give me the call from your chosen. Seal it. Seal it. We gotta seal them. We gotta seal them. Let them get sealed. All right. And then how these words gotta get sealed in you. You know. So we have sealed the servants of our power in their forehead. See. So there, there's a there's a process. There's a um, download that's happening. I'm gonna use that. Hey, we got you know. We're in the flesh, man. We're going to have bad memories. We don't want to forget, you know. And I heard, see, they go to they go to point right there. That was the point. Right. <clears throat> and that's the good news, man. That's the gospel right there, bro. That's what, that's the Lord telling. That's the book telling us through the scriptures and the angels, because um, the Lord seal your instruction in your mind when you sleep. Right. The angels come down and seal the instructions. Tell you where how it's going to go down. See. So you're not, there's no free will. You don't do what you want. You know? All right, chill out here. Ooh. So this is the good news, man. And that first step, when Yahweh Shah came down and they gave us good tidings. Teach, that's what we just read. Let's read that again. Matthew chapter 4, verse 23. And Yahweh Shah went about all the all Galilee teaching. See, that's the first thing he did. He was teaching in their synagogues. He was teaching the people, the Israelite people. Okay. Right. Maybe if somebody, whoever was around, you know, I can never, you know, but the Israelite, he was, he was in his land. Right. Teaching the in their synagogues and preaching. All right, prophesying. All right, preaching, going to the word prophesying. All right, the gospel, all right, the good news. We went into that, the rewards. But the good news, the rewards is coming to the Israelites. When he established his kingdom. And it's going to be established, man. And it's going to hurt. Yourself, man. <clears throat> when you're getting get in the way, you're going to get stepped on, man. That's it. But the kingdom is coming, bro. Preaching the gospel of the kingdom and healing. He was healing. 
And case in point, the healing works, man. He, 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 he had spiritual powers. All manners of sickness, man. And all manners of diseases amongst the people, man. So he was doing his thing, man. Right? He was doing his thing. Making it happen, man. In front of the eyes of, of, of those that... Because you know they had to believe. They see somebody laid out all the time, all this time. And then he come along and just... Call on the name of Yahweh Bashimah, on the name of Yahweh, and tell him, give him the power, and wake him, and make him heal. Come on, man. Some main person all deformed, and now he's whole. He's back. His bones are straight. Come on, man. That's real, right there, bro. They say he ain't, he ain't put no medicine inside nobody. He say we got the sign. I believe a sign. <laughs> Fuck out of here. He had to hit the spiritual powers, man. All right. All right, here go another one. All right? This is the good news, man. And, um, all right. Um, Matthew chapter 11, verse 5. The, the blind receive their sight, and the lame, and the lame walk, and the lepers, the lepers, I mean, the lepers are clean. And the deaf hear. And the dead are risen up, man. The dead, the, the Lord raised the dead, man. And the poor have the gospel. There go the word gospel, man. Good news and reward, man. Preach to them. See that? The good tidings, man. The things that's coming, you know, it, it was, uh, you can imagine what he was saying back then to them. Well, yeah, how about Shemar Shah? What are they going to do now? You probably was telling them this time. And we're telling you what's coming next. That's us preaching. Let's read that again. Matthew chapter 11, verse 5. The blind receive their sight. And the lame walk. I just told you the lame walk. It was all crippled, man. Crippled people walk. This ain't science, man. We ain't gonna, um, Elon Musk ain't going to put a microchip in your head when we get the power. We're gonna just, we're gonna, we're gonna raise you from the dead. We're gonna, we're gonna keep you, we're gonna make, we're gonna be able to walk. You ain't gonna be sick no more. Cause we, we all need, our, we need the ultimate physician, um, the healer, which is Yahweh Shah. The blind receive their sight, and the lame walk, and the lepers are clean. Ain't no more leprosy, man. What they call them, Belago, Belago, Belago. How do you pronounce it? You know, we know white spots on you, man. We're gonna be clean, man. The lepers are clean, and the deaf hear. I mean, people are gonna be having hear. They're gonna be having. They're gonna be able to hear. This is the good news, man. We're gonna do the same. We all shot said that. Um. The dead are risen up, and the poor have the gospel preached to them. The gospel's been preached. We doing that now, man. Right. And this was happening. All right, we're going to end it with this one since this one came up. It's going to be glorious, man. This is the ending right now. All right. Matthew chapter 24, verse 14. And this gospel of the kingdom shall be preached in all the world. All right, let's go into this world. world. This ain't called, let me see what this is. This is the inhabited. Oink and many. All right. The inhabited earth. All right, which is um G, thirty six twenty five. So this is happening, and and the, this gospel of the kingdom shall be preached in all the world for a witness unto all nations. This is happening now. The good news, the gospel, and then shall the end come. So we about to get it in, man. The end is almost here. This is what's happening, man. I did. Uh, this is our. Uh, I, maybe going on eight years. I've been, I've been, um, been roughly. Maybe I can't really count the date that I've been doing this ministry, right? I didn't think about. I was thinking about doing this. I didn't know I was going to be doing it. But the Lord instilled the instructions in me. We just read in Revelation that when they said we sealed the instructions, all right? So that's what's happening. 
We are, it's the end of the world, and that's why we are preaching the gospel. We're at the end. That's why all these things is happening around us. That's that's even the good news. When we hear about America and Russia talking shit to each other, that's the good. That's good news. That's the gospel. This ain't when Ronald Reagan was here. Gorbachev, bring down the wall. You ain't yo. Biden ain't messing with Putin. You forget about that. And we over Ezekiel chapter thirty-seven speaks about. Um, God and make God being a God to them. I said that right. So to who? To other nations, against America. Just say that's the good news. All right. Let's hit that. Let's hit. Let's hit one more time. Let's hit one more time. All right. Matthew chapter four, 24 verse fourteen. And this gospel, this good news, this reward of the kingdom shall be preached all in all the world for a witness. The witness against who? The, the damn damn devils, man. Unto all nations. And, and but actually the scriptures. That what's happening is a, is a sure, clear witness. We, 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 are, we are preaching it. It's clear. Unto all nations. And then shall the end come. So that's clear. So, you know, that's what we're doing, man. We're preaching the gospel, man. And it's the good news, man. All praise and honor, glory to Yabashim El Shah, Bashir Kakudash, the Wadi Yabashim El Shah for the elders, apostles, the Wadi Yabashim El Shah for all, for perfection, the Wadi Yabashim El Shah for all the issues that's cleaning us, purifying us. Shalom, shalom.